Hi, everyone. So this is my, you guys made it so fast, Richie, Lori. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Oh, gosh, you guys make me laugh. So this one is so powerful. This message, it was transmitted to me this morning from Ascended Master Maitreya um, Buddha. Oh, hi. Hi, Sherry. <laughs> my sister the mystical tarot <laughs> thank you guys for being here and um this is a powerful oh so powerful message holy moly so i'm just going to begin the transmission now from ascended master maitreya buddha begin transmission yes i have a message for you all Beloveds, be at peace within. For in this heart space of peace, you will know the truth of your being. This is a big statement. So let me repeat. You will know the truth of your being. This is multi-layered and deep. The secrets of the universe type of statement that, if practiced, will unpack and unfold untold riches within you and your conscious awareness. Remember, truth is always different for each person based on where they have their awareness placed upon. So, beloveds, where will you place your awareness given this simple yet profound key to enlightenment? Peace is profound. Peace is the oneness between the breaths. That space where all is one and no illusion exists. Expand this space within you now. Practice this expansion of sacred peace. It will begin to envelope you and your entire life. This enveloping peace surpasses understanding, for it is us, it, the very oneness of divine source God within us all. This true, the true treasure we see has been within us all along. Has it not? Give yourself over to the peace you carry in the space within your breaths. Expand it. So then he goes into the practice of how he wants you to breathe and be at that place. So this is what he says. It is taking a deep breath and holding it for as long as comfortable while at the same time visualize and feel a peace present within that space. Allow it and visualize a white light enveloping you, your entire energy field, the whole of earth. So instantaneously, as you're holding this breath, you're seeing this happen. You can use any color of light. I used white. Then on the exhale, I saw it spread even further when I exhaled. I just felt like it went on forever. It just went out there. And I did this three times myself. <laughs> Not my socks off. I had to like ground myself after. But those of you who have, who have meditated for years, get to this place where your breath is breathing you. It's like your breath disappears. When you're chanting the Om or in that way, your breath almost stops. It's that space that this creates. That, in my view, is what's happening because I've experienced it before. And there's some profound oneness that happens, some profound place, but I never defined it or understood what it was. So then you exhale and repeat, and I did it three times, and that was like powerful oh my gosh it really is transformative 
So then I'll go on with his message. This can be done when you are mindfully present. At any time, you are not operating your mechanical devices. You will see and feel immediate results of peace perme permeating your entire being. And so, too, will humanity and the world benefit from this practice. Because you're sending light out, right? To everyone and everything. This oneness, this resonance. And as we learned from... Um, St. Germain, it's all in the ethers, the resonance. So getting back to the message, even if you only do three breaths of the peace between the breaths, each day you and your world will shift in unfathomably powerful ways, my beloveds. I am Maitreya, and I love you all dearly, beloveds. I send you my blessings. Farewell until next time. End of transmission. So I wrote, this is what I wrote for what happened with me. Um, <laughs> I'm saying, looking back on the message too, isn't it true that some of the greatest secrets for transformation are hidden in plain sight? For only the adept will search it out and practice it like breath work, which is Pranayama, or meditation, or even the watching your thoughts, connecting and communicating with our guides, sitting in our own soul and divine source energies every day. They're all these keys to transformation. But breath is number one. That just, that breath, there's something sacred about the breath and what that can do to transform you. So I tried this and with three breaths and it was so powerful. I had to ground myself, as I said before, after bringing, by bringing up the energies of mother earth to tether me to the ground, I felt this powerful peace envelope me and a calm, serene oneness uh, with all that is. But again, as I mentioned in an earlier video, I felt some stuff come up from me, some stuff, and it, I don't, it wasn't triggering stuff, but it was just stuff, and it's like, you're in this oneness energy, you're in this peace, and what doesn't resonate with it has to leave you, <laughs> so, violet flame, violet flame, violet flame, <laughs> again, after this practice, Picture the violet flame. I do it coming up straight from earth, however, or coming down, however you want to do it, completely enveloping you. And you, you can picture it burning away everything that comes out of you or evaporating it, however you like to see that. And I, you can say to your out loud, I release all blocks and all things that no longer, energies that no longer resonate with me. And I send it back to divine source for transmutation. However you want to say it, that's your intention. There's the violet flame. Because I see that with all these practices, stuff's coming out. <laughs> so it has to go somewhere. You're changing your resonance. And what doesn't resonate with you is going to leave, right? So this is a graceful way. The violet flame is a graceful way to, to release. Um, so I, I think that's really important to remember that with all these practices, don't forget to uh, clear, clear yourself that way. I'm sorry, making noise. Um, make sure you're grounded. I go for the full boat grounding. I bring up, I, it's like I'm... It's like Mother Earth, the whole entire Earth, I'm standing on top of it, and I bring the seminal green energy of Mother Earth right up over my head. That's how much grounding I need. So um, I hope that you find this helpful. And I know for me, what that breathing practice, wow. <laughs> you might want to do it 
when you come home from work instead of starting the day like that because man if you're like me you could be a space cadet <laughs> so it brings you that peace and oneness but you're in this altered state of divine beingness or oneness i can't even explain it you'll have to try it but i know this isn't a new invention but he's bringing this to our awareness simple simple thing three breaths a day i mean you don't really even have to do more than that he said you could do it one time and you would have monumental changes so um <laughs> so anyway thank you all you guys for coming and i really appreciate you all richie laurie sherry jules niner lauren um bora bora who is janet um you guys are awesome for showing up and thank you for giving me all that great energy back <laughs> but um i think uh shaw woman hi uh so i think you know this is going to be something that we are going to try and implement in our lives or whenever you can think of it and see go slow like with the breath start with one breath if you want but maybe do it on a weekend when you don't have to go anywhere to see how it works inside your body but man it it was powerful for me um so i hope you got a lot from this and um i really am thankful that you were all here i love you all so much and um i'll see you on another day with another transmission from whoever shows up and uh, also if you have any requests um for some one or send a master um that we haven't done you know or maybe we have done and you have a specific question in mind you know go ahead and throw it in the um messages after and i'll look at it and we'll see what we can do <laughs> okay you guys i love you all i'm gonna say goodbye for now Thank you so much for coming. Bye-bye.